Let's discuss ID verification on the website. Today, in this video, we will discover why the verification is needed and how this process works. If you are relatively young, then you must have a cross ID verification process to pass face control or buy some goods in a store. It should be done in order to make sure that the buyer has the right to purchase this product or enter the 18 plus or 21 plus club. And after all, such a request arises even in the situation when the seller or the security guard sees you in person. The law requires this check to be completed, otherwise the organization will face punishment and large fees for access to the BIN staff for minors. And now let's imagine how the website works. It is used from different devices via the internet. There, users register, download information, watch content, and you need to make sure who is doing all this. The laws that govern age verification requirements for different countries may differ, but in general, they come down to approximately the same format. And this is what it is. When publishing material on the site by creators or performers, a license for the right to use this material is transferred to the site. And then the site has the right to publish this content over the internet. At the time of publication, this content is being disturbed and there is a law against the distribution of child porn. The law is strict and therefore just clicking on the pop-up window, I am already above 18, is not enough. You need to check the documents of the owner of this content and also make sure that the document belongs to him or her. As a rule, it is enough to upload two photos, a photo of ID so the age is visible and a photo of yourself with an ID in your hands. It is also important to ensure that the published content belongs to the person authorized by the site and that the other people do not appear in shot. Otherwise, verification of their age will also be required. How is verification organized on the site? Usually, for small sites, this can be done manually by the administrator. Automating this process for a small number of creators is not particularly difficult. Let me show how it works in our product, Scryl Connect. This is how it is implemented on the Scryl Connect platform. While applying for becoming a creator, apart from your personal information, you need to verify your identity and age. So you just need to simply upload your photo or scan of your ID and a photo where you hold this ID. Let us do it all together. So here's the template, or it can be your ID basically. And here is the photo of me holding the ID sticker, but anyways, that's how it works. And then you click the continue button. That's it. As the admin of the platform, you have an ability to check and verify each particular user who wants to become a creator on your platform. What you just need to do is to go to the profile of this user, scroll down, and then check the identity verification documents. By clicking on the ID scan, you see the ID scan just right in the next tab. And by clicking on the photo with ID, the photo is downloaded to your computer. And then what you need to do is, apart from checking all the personal data, you can approve or decline this particular user. As you can see, it's quite simple. Easy to upload photos, easy to check them. Documents are stored in the creator's profile and cannot be deleted. You can contact them at any time to verify their age. With a heavy load, it makes sense to make this process less time consuming. And there are a lot of services for this. You can easily find them by searching the web or refer to our catalogs such as the G2 website. I will not dive into the details of each service, especially since each of them is developing quite intensively. But no matter what service you choose, we can integrate it for you into your Scryl Connect platform. Let us know in the comment section down below what age verification services you used. It will be interesting for us and our channel subscribers to know. See you soon. Bye.